my name is Pablo Gallardo. I'm a medicine man who's been sharing Yopo medicine for around 12 years now. And um, I've been doing this career pretty much my whole life, all right? And um, I'm now here to present you this project, which is called Spirit Retreat Center. So can you describe what is holistic and acneogenic medicine? Yes, uh, it's, um, I saw when you wrote the word holistic, it's with H, but at the same time I love the way you put it, like holistic, because it makes more sense, right? The word holistic, um, let's put it as whole, means everything related to the spiritual world, right? To the spiritual uh, cults, the spiritual practices that comes from ancient origins or from the beginning of uh, creation up to now. So we can uh, say that entheogenics and holistic, they're all on the same branch. Entheo or entheogenics, the word entheo comes from theo and means one with God in Greek. Right, so entheogenic is that substance that will allow you to be one with God. That's pretty much what it is. Thank you. How long have people been using holistic and acneogenic medicine? Right. Following the Achacana, the history of creation, which is the cross, the Holy Cross from the Aztecs and the Incas, they say that the Holy Cross or the design was made more than 11,000 years ago. So we can suppose, I cannot say an exact date of where the medicine was uh, like uh, teach to the other tribes. Um, it was more than 11,000 years ago, right? So we can say the medicine comes even from the moment of creation, right? Now, can you tell us about why you first began to start sharing medicine and why you continue to share it? Yes, I first started to share medicine because I was an addict. I, I was a drug dealer and uh, pretty much was addicted to cocaine and crack for more than two years. I was also a drunk man and I really did. I went to jail and uh, from that jail experience it did not last very much in it because like I guess everybody was smart and I always saved money in order to bail myself. So I did not spend much time but for me, that was enough experience in order to learn uh, that that's not what I was meant to do in my life as a purpose. And suddenly, just like that, uh, something that I was looking for, uh, I was searching around for a long time, it appeared in front of me, which was a medicine, and I had the opportunity to have the medicines of different types with the guardians and guides and masters of this one. In this case, my first experience was uh, with Abuelo Taita Kelvin, and then I went more profound into the medicine of my country, which is the medicine of the Yoko. And uh, then I started to learn with grandfather there. So the point in all this is that through the whole process of knowing the medicine from my country and my purpose, is where I was. I went into a process of healing myself. So I stopped doing alcohol, stopped doing drugs, and stopped doing many other habits, uh, even psychological, physical habits that I had before. So it's been a process of cleansing and finding myself all through. All right? and what kept me going is that uh, the same way I saw benefits in myself and the medicine, it's the same way I'm sharing it with others. So like I said yesterday, this is a gift that is given from the jungle. The gift does not come from me, but it comes from the jungle, it comes from the Amazon, it comes from the Biala tribes, it comes from the Amazon. So right now, there is a gift being shared from the tribe. Now, can you describe what holistic and apneogenic medicine treats? Right. I could describe in an integral way. Right. The theogenic and holistic medicines can treat all types of uh, pathogens, including uh, viruses, uh, bacteria, fungus, and parasites. And the reason is because of the physical reaction that we have when we do the medicine. First thing 
we experienced that we we're going to sweat, so we had a type of um, cellular porous detox. Uh, the next thing is that we're going to purge and we're going to clean our bile. So uh, the bile is very important because it is the one that uh, processes all the uh, fat and cholesterol in our body. And also, if you have bacteria and parasites in your stomach, it, most of the time it gets the residuals in the in a, the sick bile. So that's where this, they feed from. If you don't have a sick bile, you don't have a, a, a proper environment for all the pathogens to live in there. So if you have a healthy bile, then you have healthy bacteria, which is the ones that you want because they're the ones that produce the antibiotics in our body. All right. So. In an integral way, the medicine helps physically, psychologically, and spiritually.